Jay, how do you feel about where this offensive line is at through four games? Um, I felt like in the last game we actually made a lot of improvement. Um, there are several times when we go back and watch it, I mean, we are knocking them off the ball two or three yards. So, um, you know, anyone that tries and say there wasn't much push this last game, they must not have been watching the football game. So, I mean, we uh, I thought we made a lot of improvement, things that we can still improve on. But um, I was really happy. I mean, we had two – me, Tyrone graded out at 95, I graded out at 93, and no one graded out below in 88, I believe. So, it's pretty good. Do you feel like your rhythm as a unit has improved in each game? Yeah, yeah. And, I mean, and that's, that's all you can ask. I mean, um, I feel like where we are this year is actually a little bit beyond where we were this time last year. Um, you know, especially with just what we know what we have as well, too. So, um, I mean, I'm, I'm excited to see us continuing to grow and um, – get more gelled, you know, even just as the season goes. With so much attention to Lamar Jackson, do you feel like your guy might be getting overlooked a little bit? Oh, well, I mean, you know, Lamar Jackson, he, he came out and had all those touchdowns and whatnot. I mean, it it doesn't really matter, you know, whenever it comes down to it. All we want to do is win football games. I mean, we know we got a pretty, pretty good quarterback here in Clemson, South Carolina. So, um, I mean, you know, we try not to worry too much about that, though. Are you surprised that the defense is over? are loading up on you guys to stop Wayne and just kind of leaving it out there on the open, those wide receivers are open. Well, I mean, you know, they're kind of, yeah, but at the same time, you know, I feel like with our offense, it's kind of a pick your poison type deal. It's either, well, we can either stop the run or we can stop the pass. So, you know, which way, you know, which way you want to go, you want to go slow or fast. So, um, I mean, it. It's to us, you know, that's one thing that's so good about our team, you know, especially our offense, is that we're so selfless. And, you know, whenever we do need to throw the ball, we throw the ball, you know, and it's not like anyone's complaining. You know, Wayne's not over there complaining. You know, I mean, he, he's doing what he's got to do. And then, you know, if we got to run the ball, then we'll run the ball. And the guys on the outside are complaining. So uh, that's really good about our offense. And I feel like uh, throughout the season, that'll really start to work in our favor. Speaking of Wayne, you got to love the way he's sticking his nose in there on pass pros, just really taking guys out. Yeah, yeah, and uh, I know that was a pretty big point of emphasis for Coach Elliott and the running backs this year and this past off season. So it's obvious that I feel like they've gotten better at, uh, at pass protection. Is there a little more sense of urgency? You talk about this group wanting to gel and taking these next steps, but do you feel greater sense of urgency this week considering who you're playing the number one scoring offense in the country and how to try to keep up with it? Oh, well, I mean, it all comes down to trust your defense as well. I mean, we, we're not going to prepare any different this week than we have any other week. You know, Coach Twenty does a good job at every week being the biggest game, no matter what game it is. Um, so, you know, it's, it's like he told us, you didn't think South Carolina State was a big game, just go lose it. And so, um, uh, yeah, we're just going to continue to prepare like we do. And, uh, I mean, we know we have a sense of urgency that we need. And... Once again, we're getting better every week, and that's all you can ask. Whenever you know, just every day you come in there and get one percent better, and then eventually by the end of the season, you're where you need to be.